hello guys welcome to our channel today we are back with another video and uh, in this video we are going to see about uh, a canary topic so where we will include a, a network node and we will uh, do some small capture script to print a hello world or something like that so let's uh, start the canary i have installed the latest one uh, which is again a demo version so you will get a pop-up of uh, you are using a demo license there we will proceed further take some time to start okay so now what we will do uh, we will go on with uh, creating a new configuration which is a simple one with uh, one channel there we have other configurations like uh, j1587 or uh, j1589 or even the advanced things like automotive ethernet and things like that so for now we will stick with the can let's just sync up this uh, window uh, that you can do that from the layout uh, box so i'm choosing vertical there and uh, on your uh, top left i mean like on your left uh, most things you can see that we have like lot of things called uh, nodes interactive generator and channels like that so it's like an overall structure of your current configuration uh, it's been added by default by this uh, canoe tool and uh, to your right it's a measurement uh, setup like where you can feed your uh, recorded can file so that you can uh, replay that and visualize the things like that And moving on, we have this uh, simulation setup, uh, which will be like talking about our current configuration. We can add uh, IG blocks and replay blocks and even databases like uh, in this uh, structure. So, uh, so this is like, uh, this is start button you guys all know. And uh, below we have this right window, which is similar to the console logs or uh, where our output gets printed. So you can see like we have started the measurement and you can see some relevant traces there like start of the measurement is there and a few other informations uh, will be there and uh, this is where or uh, whatever print statements that we are giving in our capital script will will get printed so we'll stop it for now and you can see like uh, the demo version has been stopped and uh, some time stamp related things so we'll add a uh, network node and uh, inside the network node we have to add a capital script for that so when you click on this uh, uh, pencil like icon it will directly open the uh, capital browser or uh, it, it is currently asking me to load a capital file there i'm not sure like for what reason but we will add a uh, uh, create a capital file and then we will load it to the uh, ecu that uh, party particular network node what but whatever we have created now You can think about this capital browser just like an IDE we use, like PyCharm or Visual Studio. So this capital browser is an IDE for our capital scripting. Uh, we can even use a Notepad or any other uh, uh, code editor, but uh, the capital browser will have some advanced uh, or uh, some uh, user uh, aided functionalities, which we will see. So you can see like the middle portion is where we will write the code and uh, the leftmost thing is like uh, some value objects can and includes it's like uh, whatever parameters are, are there inside the code block will be uh, outlined on the left uh, most uh, side and towards our right we have some of the uh, a capital functions like the default things which are supported by the uh, capital uh, program so you can easily drag and drop and it will automatically create the code block for you so you can see like on bus on off and uh, same like lot of default things which uh, we can use easily if you have just started to learn this uh, capital scripting like uh, the these capital functions on our right our right hand like will be uh, very much useful for us and uh, below uh, to our top down we have this output window where we will uh, have this console uh, like interface so we will move on to uh, create a simple function of printing some string in the output window or like uh, as an output so we are going to include this call called like on start so this means whenever we are starting this kenoe uh, it will do some functionalities i'll just give a how this uh, drag and drop in the capital functions will work we will drag this on start and you can see it has already created a code block for us so it is that much simple so We'll again create this on start and uh, inside this function we 
we will use this uh, write command which is similar to see out or print uh, statement that we have and we will use the default hello world there and we have Mr. semicolon so the syntax is almost similar to our C programming so uh, the conventions are all same so we'll save this file now I have previously created one more capital file for the same but yeah we'll create a new one as new capital and we will save this one okay and uh, just for namesake we'll do a compilation you can see like there is no errors or warning so just looking good close this and uh, we will uh, now add this uh, capital program to our uh, network node so to do that I'm again clicking on this pencil button I'm just trying to load whatever file we have saved to this uh, ECU block so we'll go there and this is the file whatever we have created now and it is trying to open it again since like it is by default it will be in edit uh, configuration we'll just close this one and uh, probably it uh, would have like already been loaded there we'll do a compilation and uh, Yep, it has been successful there. Okay, I'll clear this uh, um, output window so that we can see these uh, uh, printing statements clearly. We'll give a clear all, and uh, when I start now, you can see that hello world is getting printed in our right window. Notice the source, uh, it says like program or model, that means it is from some other program instead of system. So this is about this video, uh, giving a short overview about the simulation setup and measurement mode uh, and like how to include our network nodes and uh, starting with just starting with the capital script. So hope you guys find this informative. Thanks for watching and I'll see you guys in another video.